she has been going through love woes after announcing a heartbreaking split from husband Kieran Haler shortly before blasting claims of a reunion. So Katie Price is undoubtedly in the mood for some pampering, so headed to a Dublin hair salon on Monday to transform her trademark blonde tresses into a deep brown hue with lengthy extensions worked through. The 39-year-old glamour model was extremely low-key in an Adidas tracksuit as she went through the lengthy motions of transforming her locks from blonde, which she often displays, while sporting a wig, to deep chestnut brown. Katie shocked her fans with her latest live tour revelation as she pulled off a wig and declared that her hair is thinning due to stress. Following her admission, Katie has undergone a hair-raising transformation as she dyed her locks dark brown while coping with the strain of her divorce from Kieran. Standing outside the salon in a stylish Adidas tracksuit that flashed a hint of her blooming bump, she went barefoot while seemingly in the middle of the process. The top of her hair was pinned high on her head before she later departed with her slick mane falling loose over her shoulders while she toted a Louis Vuitton bag. In August, the Loose Women panelist claimed her husband of four years cheated on her with their children's nanny and now attempting to move on from the fallout she has opted for a new look. In the midst of Katie's image overhaul, she was faced with claims she has taken back here in following the cheating scandal that ended their marriage. An insider told Now Magazine she can't function alone and is adamant they can make it work. She's got her experiences of divorce and simply can't face going through that again. In light of the reports, Katie has vehemently denied the claims, with her spokeswomen insisting that the pair have no immediate plans to get back together and instead they will both focus on their children. She said, Kate and Kieran are currently living in their marital home. Oh, of course their marriage is on the rocks and right now there is no future for them, however they are currently dealing with their situation privately and in their own time. Adding, Kieran is getting help and is in therapy. Despite recent speculation from sources they are both acting in the best interest of their children and family, Katie's main priority is her mum, her health, the children and her work. Getting her hair tended to by the team at South Dublin salon Sarah Lambert, the mother of five appeared to return to look from 2011 when she divorced her second husband Alex Reed and even got a head of new hair extensions to match. Sporting her look from yesteryear, Katie's new do also paid tribute to her mane of 2008 before she split with Peter Andre, who she welcomed son Junior and Princess with. Her new look comes after she caused Jaws to drop with her latest tour antics as she removed her wig to live on stage during a dramatic speech in Stoke-on-Trent last week. The former glamour model initially appeared on stage sporting a flowing caramel wig, parted in the middle and boasting soft luscious waves.
looking chic in a ruffled black dress, the reality TV star suddenly grabbed attention when she whipped the wig off in front of her fans, revealing her shorter amber locks beneath, which were scraped back in a low-maintenance ponytail. The glamorous star has previously admitted to relying on wigs and hair extensions after suffering from thinning hair due to stress. In February the surgically enhanced model bit back at a troll who accused her of going bald due to her dependence on hair extensions, saying, I've had five kids stress last year and hair loss due to it so not extension so thanks for the put down Katie has previously expressed her distaste for her natural haired look, saying she feels at her most glamorous with big and lengthy locks. The hair-raising act came after Katie reportedly told fans her cheating spouse Kieran bedded nanny Nikki Brown in the bath. The star allegedly made the explosive claim as Kieran listened on in the crowd. Katie's comments come after she announced she was divorcing Kieran after the sex addict admitted to sleeping with their nanny Nikki Brown six times, something Nikki has vehemently denied. Katie reportedly made the claim when an audience member shouted out, get rid of your cheating husband according to the son, the mum of five laughed and shot back, I'm sure he enjoyed having sex in the bath with the nanny. Mail in line contacted Katie Price's rep at the time for comment. Meanwhile, Katie has revealed her latest cosmetic procedure as she took to the stage in Stevenage for her tour. Speaking to the audience on Saturday, she admitted to going under the knife to reduce her eye bags, I've had tear through to get rid of my bags, so it looks like I've had a black eye. Despite the painful sounding work, Katie is no stranger to going under the knife, having shown off the results of her first facelift in July. The TV personality showcased the results of the 5,000-pound procedure designed to boost sagging cheeks and jawlines on loose women at the time. Katie discussed her experience of plastic surgery during her stint on loose women, revealing there was pressure to keep up with younger women. She recalled, I know when I have too much lips filler, when I see myself on TV and pictures, and I'm like oh my god, I look like a duck. Katie also admitted that her son Jr. had warned her about having too much work done on her face. The mother of five explained, this is what Junior said, mum you are so beautiful. Why did you have to have it done I was like, I haven't had that much done Junior. And he said, mum, your eyebrows are fake, you've got fake eyelashes on. You've had your lips done, you've had your nose done, and your teeth. And now you've put these things in your face, why and I didn't have a comeback. Because he's actually right. Despite a long history of cosmetic procedures, this was the first time Katie has ever gone under the knife for a facial rejuvenation. Katie's facelift is the latest in a long line of cosmetic procedures, which began with the first of eight breast augmentations in 1998. She's also undergone rhinoplasty 
teeth than ears, bottom lifts, liposuctioning has a regular Botox and dermal filler regime. The procedure was carried out by cosmetic surgeon Chris Inglefield at London Bridge Plastic Surgery and Aesthetic Clinic who said he was delighted that Katie is so pleased with